It all started with a broken blender jar. Rather than toss the base, a neighbor suggested Alita post a request on a website that matches people who have things to give away with people who need things. It wasn't 10 or 15 minutes when I got an email. I have one. Come get it. It was amazing. I said, is this for real? <laughs> that experience made Alita an avid recycler. I got a garden hose and I got some earth too. And transformed her muddy backyard into a garden with recycled stones and marble. Alita gives as much as she receives. Sheet music, books, CDs, and... All wool red hat available for pickup this week. This is a peel box style hat. She leaves them on her front porch for pickup. I am very happy that went to a lady that I know will appreciate it. It's an amazing way to get people to know that they uh, are part of a community that share what they have. FreeCycle is committed to keeping usable things out of landfills. Every year they recycle over 200 million tons of gently used computers, furniture, appliances, garden supplies, and this claw bathtub that Alita repaired. It became the inspiration for a new bathroom. I am so proud of it. The sink and toilet also came through FreeCycle. I give those items a second chance. To participate, you join a group in your neighborhood. Post items you want to give away or receive. Everything posted must be free, legal, and not offensive. When people get back to you, you decide who to give the item to and how. For me, it's a frill when you get to go to the doorstep and you get those items. Um, you're just so excited. <laughs> Sandra Benitez-Taylor moderates her local free cycle group. If someone doesn't want strangers coming to their home, she counsels them to find another place to leave things. One member leaves things on the island. You don't know where her house is, you don't know who she is, but she's been incredibly reliable and you know the items are always there. Free cycle is more than a place to get free stuff. It's also a place to make friends. Sandra learned that after her baby was born. How are you? I came back from the hospital with over 40 emails waiting for me. Uh, people making sure I was okay, people offering to cook me dinner. Uh, people dropped off diapers, people dropped off wipes. I mean, it's been really cool. <laughs> Having a supportive community became very important after her husband shipped out to Afghanistan. This is a third tour. Free Cycle helps us out a lot. It gives me a sense of community um, and gives me a sense of being able to have friends while he's away. Next year, Sandra and her family will be in Germany. The military will move their belongings. What I don't want to have to move, I'm just going to free cycle it. You can save so many things by letting somebody else enjoy them that needs them. After all, you never know when you might need a blender jar, paper towel holder, toaster, puzzles, or baskets, or a friend to share it with. Yummy. Discover hundreds of ways to do good in your community. Whether you have five minutes or five hours to spare, Create the Good can show you how easy it is to do on your time and your terms. Learn more at createthegood.org.